All right, I had to tell y'all this as soon as I got up. Today is April 21st. It's a powerful day, they say. I'm saying they, like you may see those pages of people that are really talking that talk. Like I said, I'm a lifelong learner, but all I know is they say Jupiter and Uranus, I believe. Planets are colliding, big energy popping. All right, as I just opened up my blinds, y'all, oh my goodness. I'm gonna just go ahead and show y'all this picture. It's my patio. There's a ball right here. Let me give you the backstory as yes, let me show you. The ball is not there this morning. I wonder where it just magically appeared to. I cannot make this up. All right, it has been a rodeo kind of staying in this apartment. And there's just been a couple nuisances, as I'm sure you can imagine, apartment living. But right here, this tell me somebody came over my patio and came and grabbed that ball. Because <laughs> I was going to leave it there. Let me tell y'all what happened yesterday on 420. Oh, actually, let me go a little bit back. There's a neighbor, not outside of the ones below me right now, that's pretty recent. But these neighbors have been here probably for like a little bit longer. Anyway, they have kids. And as you know, sometimes when kids get to playing outside, th there can be things that come up. But this is where us as parents should have conversation. Well, there was one instance at the bus stop where, and maybe I'll share this video. I'm going to try to find it. And so check it out. But I know I posted it at one point uh, where the, the dad was being really aggressive at the bus stop. And he was saying all kind of things. Anyway, y'all, I'm giving y'all this good lighting and I just woke up to this. Oh my God. Fast forward, I don't fool with them people. They ain't right in the head. Okay, big energy popping, right? There's a grass area and it's pretty big over here. And we've pretty much established, I'm gonna make sure my kids don't play with yours. You damn show, make sure your kids don't play with mine or talk to mine. Well, they're out here playing baseball, as you all seen the ball. And I am refilling my bird feeder yesterday. And I'm noticing they're playing baseball. But they're also pointing it towards my direction. Like, there's another field, you know, where the kids could possibly play baseball. Just thinking conflict resolution type of things. Like, if you know that there's been issues or if the parent is being on top of things and reminds their kids, maybe you shouldn't go over there or maybe... Don't be putting your ball in and facing it towards their patio. All right. But of course, learn lessons that we figure out along the way. And kids going to be kids. But they be in some nuisances. I tell you that much. Now, they are like looking at my patio. And of course, I'm out there as well. So there's that. Uh, well, I'm not out there. I just have my windows open and I'm kind of out there because I'm refilling my birds. I'm about to feed my baby, bird babies. Y'all see what happened. All right, so they noticed. Then I went ahead and I looked and I'm like, oh, their they're ball is out here. And because also I want to encourage you all, this is the message, especially is there's some big energy today, yesterday, look, every day, but especially today, that sometimes you could be tested, all right? And that was a point of test. And I was in a very peaceful, joyful, happy place yesterday and really trying to be productive and get some things done in the house. So maybe y'all could think, oh, you could have just, you know, took the ball and threw it back at him. Mm -mm. That's not what I was going to do. I wasn't going to waste my good energy and do that at that moment. I wasn't going to do it when they wanted me to do it because they wanted me to do it. I could tell. Then they got one of the neighbors. Adult. Well, first I heard the kids say, let's go tell the mom. And then, you know, they got another neighbor who they were playing with parent who I'm guessing maybe it was their ball or maybe they wanted to just have this other person come and get in the mix even though it wasn't their kids that actually did it so I say all that to say they come to my door they're ringing the doorbell and I'm not answering now eventually I was gonna end up you know give them their ball actually I wasn't gonna give it their ball I was just gonna throw it back over when I decided and got a moment like I said the message here is to really protect your energy y'all but the fact that I woke up this morning and that ball ain't there is definitely unsettling. And sometimes you get reminders that maybe it may be time to move on. And it's certain instances that happen that could be uncomfortable that maybe are a reminder that there's something greater out there. That's y'all reminder today. Yeah, get your kids though. Also, disclaimer, I did not have my kids yesterday. They have not been with me during the week, so they was not outside. And... I'm just saying, this right here, the fact that that ball ain't there no more tells me somebody was up to no good and was it really that serious? Are y'all really that damn broke? 
But y'all couldn't get another ball or wait a minute or no. Somebody is not going to be on your timing. Mm -mm -mm. And here it was yesterday. I was driving around looking at all the homes <laughs> manifested.